I'm Margaret Blum. I lead the Advanced Technology Program and Nanotechnology here at DD Global Research. And believe it or not, we spend a lot of our time learning from nature. Nature does nanotechnology extremely well. One of the uh, examples we've had the most success with is the lotus leaf, where we've taken chemistry we've learned from studying lotus leaves, to turning that into, believe it or not, ice phobic coatings. We've been working on ice phobic coatings for several years, working on coatings that ice doesn't stick to. We all know ice is an unsolved problem. All of us have a lot of challenges every day in the winter in dealing with ice. Wouldn't it be great to have a coating that ice didn't stick to? Well, that's what we're trying to do with technology that we've developed, again, starting from that simple lotus leaf. We'd like to use those coatings that we develop in our aircraft engine business and our energy business to make more efficient wind turbines. Here we are in our harsh environment testing lab where I'm standing next to our ice tunnels. Here we've built a small wind tunnel that we can use to develop atmospheric icing conditions. So we can model and simulate ice formed outdoors rather than ice in your freezer. There are many, many different types of ice. And the types of ice we want to reduce are the types formed outside in the atmosphere. So this tunnel can simulate many different conditions, let us better understand the interaction of ice and our materials so that we can better develop the best coating and get into our products. 